making a brand new Peking account starting with 100 mil. In the last episode we managed to get ourselves 78 combat with 80 strength, 83 range, 82 magic and of course full void. In today's episode we are going to evolve this account into something much greater. Hope you guys enjoy. And always good to know, we start this episode with a bank value of 75.1 million. 85 magic, we can now do Teleblock. After doing a lot of research, I've come to the conclusion that this account needs a heavy ballista. Therefore, I am going to work towards Monkey Madness 2. I have a lot of skills I need to level and a lot of quests I need to do. So we're gonna start working towards that. But before we continue this episode, I am very happy to present today's sponsor, which is Raid Shadow Legends. It is the sensation of the mobile world, the new generation's RPG. This is actually the game I've been playing for the last few weeks while I was traveling in Thailand. With or without Wi-Fi, you can play raids everywhere. My favorite thing to do on raids are the dungeons you can battle in. Here you can fight against many different bosses and win new artifacts that will help your champions be much, much stronger. So what are you waiting for? Go to the video description right now, click on the special links, and if you're a new player, you will get 100,000 silver and a free champion, the great, the badass, Hexweaver. All this treasure will be waiting for you here in your inbox for the next 30 days. Good luck, and I'll see you there. Forty mining. Watchtower quest completed. Forty, fifty, sixty, and seventy crafting. Fifty-five thieving. Forty agility. Look, I'm floating like Harry Potter. Fifty agility. Fifty-five agility. Ten, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty hunter. Another requirement completed. Now on to the longest grind yet, 69 Slayer, starting with 23. Dwarf Cannon quest completed for the Dwarf Cannon. I'm going to get myself 69 Slayer by doing Konar and Wilderness Slayer. And we're gonna open all the keys when we reach 69 Slayer. 30 Slayer, 40 Slayer, 50 Slayer. I got a kill. Easy kill. Let's see the price check. 286k. Since I just got myself 55 Slayer, I can now upgrade myself to an imbued Slayer helmet. This helmet provides me plus 15% increased range damage when doing Slayer. 60 Slayer. 90 range. Oh, that was a long grind, but there we go. 69 Slayer. And that's the final skilling requirement for the Monk Madness. Now we only have a few quests left to do. However, we started this episode with a bank value of 75 mil. Now we're down at a bank value of 58 mil. That means 17 mil loss. And during this grind, we gathered ourselves 40 Lance keys, 14 Brimmy keys, 8 hard caskets, and 5 medium caskets. So if we're lucky after opening these, we won't go too much of a loss. We start off by opening 14 Brimmy keys. Good luck. <laughs> From 14 Brimmy Keys, we got 1.48 mil. That's a decent start. And this is the loot from 40 Larence Keys. Plate legs. So we, we got a total of 5.4 mil from the Larence keys. This makes our bank value 64.6 mil. This means we need 11 mil from the clue caskets to break even. Alright, and from the medium casket we get nothing, 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 a massive clue scroll, and nothing. And from the hard caskets we get Sardom and Crozier, basically nothing, another nothing. Nothing, 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 nothing. Journey of Lightning, completed. Eyes of Glowfire, completed. That's Monkey Madness, completed. Completed, baby, that's what I'm talking about. I really didn't want to do this, but I had to 
The account has now officially been destroyed, 52 attack, 45 defense. But that's totally fine, in a few days we are getting our stats up even higher. There's a guy fishing from the well. What the fuck? How do you do that? She, she's completely missing the well. And the last requirement I need for Monkey Man's 2 is 70 cooking. We start with 42. 60 cooking. 70 cooking? Completed. Now we can actually start doing the quest. Finally, I've been waiting for so long. And there we go, King Awogogui have officially been freed. I freed the Lumbridge Guide as well for the room gloves. Everything we have done until this point was to simply complete this quest. Monkey Madness 2 have now officially been completed. The grind, the grind is now officially over. Ah oh, man, this is so powerful, so strong and so beautiful. It is time for me to test out this heavy ballista in PKing situations. And of course the max hit is 49 and with the special attack 62. And remember, I am only combat 82. I got a kill! I got a kill! I got a kill! And I died. A great investment, the rune pouch. And I died. Another kill, another kill, another kill, another kill, another kill, another kill. Yeah, another kill for this guy. He killed me three times now. So review number one of peeking on this combat bracket with a heavy ballista. It's fantastic, so easy to PK with this combat bracket. And this build is so overpowered. If I can get myself vengeance as well, I will be undefeatable. There we go, good fight man. <gasps> oh, light ballista PK, sick. Oh my god, that's big, that's a big PK with an emblem too. 930k PK. And he's dead. I hate my life. I hate my life, it says. I feel bad for that guy. All right, we got ourselves a challenge at TYC from Gagex, and they want me to kill your target with no ring or neck items equipped. Good fight, we completed the challenge and we got tier. Nice. The emblem upgrade used to be so simple in Bounty Hunter. You kill a target and the emblem gets upgraded. But now since the update, it all has changed. I just killed a target and I didn't get an upgrade. But either way, we smited him for his Gmall as well, so 400k PK. Oh my god. Oh! Jagex, can you please make tier 1 emblems stackable? Thank you very much. Alright, that is going to be enough Bounty Hunter for this week. We got 134 points. We're gonna use it all on Bounty Crates. And we got almost 20 crates. Let's open them. Combat Potion emblem. Nice. Ooh. We got one big one. Let's see here. How much did we make? 2.5 mil. Um, I actually made profit. It's time for some hybrid peaking using magic and range. Good luck to me. We got a kill. Beautiful. 140k PK. Nice. Oh. Good fight. Good fight. That's a Gmall. 450k. I could barely find any fights, so back to BHPK. Oh, I killed him. 420k, the weed number. All right, let's complete our challenge. No ring or necklace equipped. Good fight. We completed the challenge. We got 13 points. Beautiful kill. 730k. Good! Good fight. He called me a F. -y. He called me the F word. That's mean. But we got a leaf blue. 135k. And with that kill, we're gonna end the episode. Our current bank value is 62.8 mil. And in the next episode, we are going to take this account to the next level. Hope you guys enjoyed. Mm -hmm.